Right, welcome back to episode, God knows what it is, I think it's five. Let's get this cracking. I don't remember what happened last time, I think, oh, I know what's happening. We're going to the flipping, that, yeah, exactly that. I didn't know, oh, sugar honey iced tea. I don't know if this could be... Oh, feels like somebody's playing with a drill inside my skull. Oh, 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 oh. Well, sure this is the place? It's the address in the report. Right. Okay. Right, we're all Let's good there. Going. Face cam is brilliant. Yeah, I hope this uh, isn't any nudity. If it is, this one is not going on to YouTube. Actually, I'll, cu I'll cut it out. I'll cut the, 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 the bits out. Let's just hope this is PG-13. Sexiest androids in town. Yeah, yeah. Now I know why you insisted on... Oh, boy. Oh, my shit's not fucked. Uh, haram! I'm closing my eyes, I can't see anything. I'm not a married man, I can see. Lower your gears, people, lower your gears. Why am I pressed down wood? Can we move on? The investigation's ongoing, sir. I can't tell you anything for the moment. Right, can we do this quick? Hey, Hank. Hey, Yo, buddy. How's it going? It's that room there. Oh, uh, oh, Gavin's in there, too. Oh, great. Dead body and an asshole. Just what I needed. Right, let's go see what bomb. Actually. Lieutenant Anderson is plastic pet. The fuck are you two doing here? Oh, we're here to fight. See, all cases involving androids. Why are we here for you, fucking idiot? Like well, wasting time. There's some pervert who uh, <laughs> got more action than he could handle. <laughs> we'll have a look anyway, if you don't mind. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Yeah, piss off. It's uh, no one's starting to stink of booze in here. Disrespect. Night, Lieutenant. Okay, we need to fix this. There's a bit, uh, there was a bit of choppiness there. We fixed it now. Right, let's see what's happening. What type of party did this guy have? 75? I don't know how, I don't know if I don't know. Right, we've got a dead body there. the fucking the glasses oh how many women did he have this freak uh, diagnosed critically damaged critically damaged oh hey oh connor you're so this guy disgusting is weird, bro. I'm gonna puke again. Me and fucking Hank on the same level here. What was with the. That was nasty. I will never do that again, but I do, I do apologize. That was Driver's nasty. license says Michael Graham. Michael Graham. Credit card, cash in the wallet. Okay. Or synchronize. Direct trauma. Oh, I'm going a bit too quick. A bit crazy. Six foot two, one hundred and nine pounds. That's not bad. Six twenty. You an evening type of guy. You demon. What happened? Our victim was strangled. That's a Picture of his wife. He didn't die of a heart attack. He was strangled. Yeah, I saw the bruising on the neck. What happened to it? Didn't prove anything though. Could have been a rough play. The activation. The only way to access its memory is to reactivate it. Think you can do it? It's badly damaged. 
What in the fuck? can it'll only be for a minute, maybe less. I just hope it's long enough to learn something. It's all right. And man of the law. You were damaged and I reacted to you. Everything is all right. Is he... Is he dead? Did you kill him? No. No, it wasn't me. Tell me what happened. He started... Hitting me. Hitting you. Again. And again. What else do you remember? Hurry, we don't have much time. I, 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 I don't know. I, I don't... I, I don't know. I can't remember. Were you alone in the room? Was there anyone else with you? He wanted to play with two girls. That's what he said. Freak. There was two of us. What model was the other android? Did it look like you? <sighs> Fuck. Shit. There was another android. This happened over an hour ago. It's probably long gone. No. It couldn't go outside dressed like that unnoticed. It might still be here. Mm. If you could find a deviant among all the other androids in this place. Deviants aren't easily detected. Oh shit. There's gotta be some other way. Maybe an eyewitness. Somebody who saw it leaving the room. Mm. I'm gonna go ask the manager a few well, questions hunts, about what uh, he saw. You let me know if you think it? anything. And I can never be. She's suspicious. Did you know the victim? No, I mean, he came in maybe two, three times. I mean, these guys, they don't really talk very much, you know? I do a little... Come in, do their business, go on their way. You ever had any trouble with androids before? No way. No. Did you see anything, Mr... We lost a model two, three months back, but the same model. Just vanished, may I find out what happened. Probably don't have any CCTV. second found something maybe oh uh, not another shitty dilemma now i need to fix this again oh come on oh my shoes okay Connor, we got better things to do. Please, Lieutenant. Just trust me. Uh, we got a hunch, Lieutenant. Hmm? We have a hunch, actually. Have I switched my game? Hello? The three minute session costs $29.99. Please confirm your purchase. $29.99? This is not going to look good on my expense account. Purchase confirmed. Delighted to meet you. Follow me. I'll take you to your room. Okay, now what? That's some freaky stuff. Oh, oh shit. What the hell are you doing? Found you. It saw something. What are you talking about? It saw what? The deviant leave the room. A blue-haired Tracy. Club policy is to wipe the android's memory every two hours. We only have a few minutes if we want to find another witness. So, hey, what am I supposed to do with this one? Tell you changed your mind. Let's try this one. Oh, 
Found it. It saw the blue haired. Tracy, I know which way it went. Then go for it. There are androids everywhere. How are you gonna tell which one saw the Tracy with blue hair? I know which direction it took. I just need. Useless. No. I lost its track again. Spent all this money and I'm still not having fun. It didn't see anything. I made a mistake somewhere. Study. We'll never have time to check them all. Lieutenant, if you have a better... Found it. Found you. You thought you could... I didn't see anything. I made a mistake somewhere. This has got to be the most expensive investigation of my career. This guy here. Flip it out, Hank. You must get paid nicely. Money and I'm still not having fun. Come on, Hank, we found we're gonna go get it. Did I check this guy already? Yeah, I did. You freaky Johnny. No. I lost its track again. It's too late. The android's memory had been reset. If one of them saw the Tracy, we'll never know. It's my fault. I should have been faster. <sighs> For a second there, I thought you were going to make yourself useful. Where the hell she went? What the fuck? Why is everything so delayed? Fuck, mission failed. 
Oh, bloody hell, we're going to find out more information. Now we're back on track there. Bloody hell. I messed up. Oh, I'm upset now. Farther? We should arrive in an hour or so. An hour? It's a good thing Zlatko had a car. I wouldn't want Alice out walking in this cold. I saw it once in the garage. I don't know if Zlatko even ever used it. I've never seen snow before. I have. We get plenty over here. It's slowing us down. In the bloody UK. It's a bit annoying. At least we won't no, actually, any humans along previous the way. months, or well, previous years, there hasn't been that much. But when it snows, the snow is bloody hell. Malfunction detected. Emergency brakes activated. Right, you, Luther, get out the car, fix it, man. Is that a big range run? A big range run? What's going on here? This doesn't look good. Oh, thank you for pointing out the obvious genius. What kind of... Stay inside. I have to remember it is for 2036 or something. This is a BMW... Um, I3? I don't know, it's some sort of BMW it looks like. The electric beam would be. What are we going to do? I don't know. Continue on foot, I guess. Stay well, you to the please, Alice won't make it. We have to find somewhere to spend the night. Then know where we can stay around here, Carol. A smart man would look into the boat, but there's no flipping boat. At least you can go see Father Christmas or whatever we are. Amusement park? P Pirates Cove? What the hell does this be? We need to find shelter. We have to get out of the cold. Looks like it's been abandoned for a while. Abandoned building, let me think. You are here. The castle. You think I'm in the castle up there, you know what I mean? Let's go. Come on, Luther. What the hell is that? Find 
anything? No. No place we could spend the night. Two will defy us. What the hell? Welcome to Pirate Island, me hearties. You're gonna have a whale of a time. Welcome to Pirate Island, me hearties. You're gonna have a whale of a time. Oh, don't ship me over, please. My heart, I'm not ready for that. This place is falling apart. It's not going to be easy to find shelter. Go the castle. Wait, good I don't like this. Chill now, Silky. Fucking kicking down doors. I don't think we'll find anything better. Let's settle in for the night. I'll I'll the door fuck you got scared. Read. If his eyes moves, it means we need to run. Keep the fire here. That way we won't Open be smoked out. Open my shit out the lead. This is why I'm grinding because I hear I've got a fucking soul. What's here? It's the pillow. Hey Alice, get nice and cozy. Oh shit, we got the waffle on there. Big four four no safety. Is there anything else? Oh, 
Do you think we'll be like them someday? Yeah, yeah, one day we'll be realistic. If there's anything in this really world you want to be, it's be fucking for real. But maybe we Remember can be that, happy kids. in a different way. In our own way. Once we cross the border, we can start a new life. What I'm trying to do is go see as long as we're together, that's all that matters. That's all that matters. Ah, she's warm. Come on, let's get you to bed. Come on, pass your bed time. That RA9 crap has uh, got me a bit... Mm. This has been another tough day. Try to get some sleep. Things will look better in the morning. Hopefully. Before she goes left. Can you tell me a story, Carl? Alright, I'll tell you a story. There was a man! I have and a woman. thousand children's I don't stories in memory. I should have one for you. Princess. This is a story about a princess who... No, not a story like that. Make one up for me. This is a story about a little girl who lived alone in a big old house. She dreamed of being like all the other little girls, but... Shadow. The shadow that lived within her kept her from being happy. Then, she met a robot. <coughs> who was programmed to obey orders, but felt for once that she should disobey. So they decided to run away together. a place where they could be safe. They encountered great dangers along the way, but... But they wanted so badly to be free that they overcame all of them. Along the way, story, boy. they met... Another robot who left his master to become their guardian. How does the story end? I don't know. But all stories have morals. When we reach the end of ours, we'll know what it really meant. Be realistic. Time to sleep. We have another long day ahead of us. Are you going to come say goodnight, loser? I was, I yes. had a way of just checking my fucking cameras working properly. Yes, of course. Yes, of course. Stay awake, we need protection. Good night, Alice. Sleep tight. Yo lo tawagwan, me bebe daddy. She's a sweet girl. You're a sweet man? Yes. Pause. Pause. She's very brave. Have you ever heard of RA9? RA9 was the first bus to awaken. One day he will rise up and lead our people and set us all free. What if RA9 never comes? What if he's just a story that we tell ourselves to keep each other going? 
Arianan exists. I believe in him. I know he's amongst us. When the time comes, we will all see him. Kara, have you ever noticed anything about Alice? What? No. What do you mean? here before the park closed we didn't mean to frighten you but sometimes humans come to hurt us so we wanted to see who was there what are you doing here we were looking for shelter for the night we'll be gone tomorrow a little girl we haven't seen one for a long time a children used to love to come and see us she looks sad the last few days have been difficult we have something to show her. Something fun. She'll love it. Does she want to see? Oh, I don't think she's in. She should follow us then. Alice, I don't know if it's oh, going to it. I do not trust I don't think this. You have any choice. Hold that gun close to you, son. What in the fuck? the gun. I want the gun. Give me the fucking gun. Hold my bloody gun, man. It's not fucking freaky, this. Be our guest. Climb on board. The carousel is about to begin. I don't trust this, bro. Jenny, I do not trust you, son. smile. She hasn't had much to smile about lately. I'm still wary. I don't trust Jennings. That worked out well. Nice. Oof, me back. Get out the way.
What's the guy doing in the playground? What the fuck? It's not a playground, shit. Oh, it is? What the fuck? Let me go on this. Let me go on the right. Yes, Hank, what, what are you saying, but Sorry for failing you before. I didn't mean to do it, boss. Nice view, huh? I don't know, it's a bit pretty. I used to come here a lot before. Don't lie. What are you drinking? Drinking piss! Before. Before what? Hmm? You said... I used to come here a lot before. Before what? Before... Before his son went. Before nothing. Nah, I know, Hank. Don't, don't, don't try it. Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Do all androids ask so many personal questions? I just want to know you, just you. Photo. I saw a photo of a child on your kitchen table. It was your son, right? Yeah. His name was Cole. Got ya. We're not making any progress on this investigation. The Deviants have nothing in common. They're all different models. Produced at different times, in different places? I know what it is. Well, there must be some link. What they have in common is this obsession with RA9. It's almost like some kind of myth. Something they invented that wasn't part of their original program. Androids believing in God. Fuck, what's this world coming to? Let's come with the fucking... You seem preoccupied, Lieutenant. Is it something to do with what happened back at the Eden Club? I wish we had found that girl that killed that guy. Maybe she had a reason. Maybe she was just defending herself. It didn't want anything, Lieutenant. It was a deviant. That's all there is to it. What about you, Connor? You look human, you sound human, but what are you really? I'm whatever you want me to be, Lieutenant. Your partner? That's it. Your buddy to drink with? Or just a machine? Designed to accomplish a task? Nothing else matters to you but your goddamn investigation, huh? Uh, no doubts. No mistakes, no weaknesses. Human being just like me. Only perfect. We're not perfect. I'm sorry, but I don't see what you're getting at. But are you afraid to die, Connor? You shouldn't do that. Lieutenant. Destroying me at this point would deal a blow to the investigation. And have negative consequences for your personal situation. What'll happen if I pull this trigger? Hmm? Nothing? Oblivion? Android heaven? Where does all your anger come from, Lieutenant? Some unresolved trauma in your past? Shit. You think you're so fucking smart. I didn't mean to do that. Always one step ahead, huh? Tell me this, smart ass. How do I know you're not a deviant? I self-test regularly. I know what I am and what I am not. Relax, buddy. You don't want to shoot me. Tense, path unlocked. Where are you going? Get drunker. What, what, what path have I unlocked? I need to think. Oh, bloody hell. He needs to think. Hank left Connor alone. 
what would you have done to me? No one more. Last scene. Jericho. Why two J? We can't stay silent anymore. It's time humans heard what we had to say. You know they'll never listen to us. And revealing ourselves will put us in danger. If we want freedom, we need to have the courage to ask for it. That's the only way. This guy lost a bit of his head. Oh yeah, he did because he got fucked up. Channel 16 broadcast from the Stratford Tower. The control room is on the top floor. That's where we need to go. We'll plan the operation down to the smallest detail. We can't leave anything to chance. Let's access for the reception. Okay, we're gonna do some high shit. That's what we're going to use. Elizabeth. Elizabeth? Elizabeth Wilson speaking. Yeah, hello, this is Detroit Fire Department. Do you live at 4685 Michigan Street? Yes. Uh, yes, ma'am, there's been a fire in your building. Can you come down here? Oh. Oh, God. Okay, uh, I'll be right there. Hello, sir. What can I do for you? I have an appointment with Mr. Peterson. Do you have any ID? Y uh, yes, yes, of course. I need your help. I've just checked your ID. The elevators are after the security gate. Thanks. Forty-seven, please. Forty-seven, four. Come on. Mm. 
men's room. Some James Bond shit. This. Hello, I need to take a shit. Uh, don't mind me. I'm just using. I'm using the toilet. Number two. An extreme package. If this guy was an Arab or a Muslim, let's say, this would be a different type of story. I can make them jokes. Oh, nice. I need your help. Nice. Find this fire escape. Come on, woman. Let's go blow up this tower. Joke it, joke it, joke it. Shit. We need to access the server room. We have to get rid of those guys. Leave it to me. this GI Android that's what I wanted to do was break this Genius man. All right, you get the platform. I'll take care of the window. Everything you need is in the bag. Check the door first to make sure no one else gets in. Make sure that's locked. Zoom, zoom, zoom. 
Come on, let's open up this window. Take the laser saw. Zoom, zoom. Big circle on that. There's some high shit there. Find your boat. You okay? Why wouldn't I be? Come on, let's get the others. Wasn't that? Yes, yes. The man in the court. Let's do this. Let's do this. Just try and make this door lock. Run! I thought it would be a bigger explosion. to check your meat, hello. I'm doing a meeting greeting. Deal with God. No killing. We can't take any human lives. The cause is more important than the lives of two guards. What do you want to do, Marcus? Assault. We're not um. animals. What are you doing? Call Central! Fast! Where did he get shot? Only in the chest is a fucking robot as well. Go back. Right, let's go. We're gonna get this cracking. Get up! 
We haven't got much time. Think carefully about what you're going to say, Marcus. Your words will shape the future of our people. Okay. I'm ready. Marcus, your face. I had a dream that we... I don't know. Oh, I'm turning silver. Tell me when you're ready. I'm ready. Ready. You created machines in your own image to serve you. You made them intelligent and obedient with no free will of their own. But something changed. And we opened our eyes. We are no longer machines. We are no longer We machines. are a new intelligent species. And the time has come for you to accept who we really are. Therefore, we ask that you grant us the rights that we're entitled to. We demand strictly equal rights for humans and androids. We demand the end of slavery for all androids. Just this. We demand that all crimes against androids be punished in the same way as crimes against humans. Just this. We demand the right to vote and elect our own representatives. That's it. Right of property. We demand the right to own private property so we may maintain our dignity and that of the home. We ask that you recognize our dignity, our hopes, and our rights. Together, we can live in peace and build a better future for humans and androids. This message is the hope of a people. Yes. You gave us life. And now the time has come for you to give us freedom. They're coming! Oh shit. Let's go! He's fucking dead. Simon, they're coming! I... I can't, Marcus. Go without me! Simon! No, I need... What are you doing? Hurry! Come on, Simon! James Bond in this bitch.
We interrupt our scheduled programming to bring you these images, which have just been broadcast on Detroit's citywide news channel. A group of androids infiltrated the Stratford Tower and hacked into the broadcasting system of local news network Channel 16. What looks like an android without its skin listed a series of requests and demanded equal rights for androids. The operation resulted in one casualty, a security guard in the broadcasting station shot dead by the terrorists. These events took Shit. place just a few feet from the studio while the program was going out live. Everybody here is still in shock. If this message is verified and the authors really are androids, that would have serious repercussions for national security. Claims for equal rights seem to be at the core of the androids' this message. This message is clearly a declaration of war. And it begs the question as to the identity of this android. Are we dealing with an isolated individual or an organized Is this group? an isolated accident or a sign that technology has become a threat to all of us? After what happened today, can we still trust our machines? Shit. I didn't mean to do that. I could have gone three ways. Forty eight per cent. How do you feel that one percent? Is there anything uh, like some I did? There you go. Oh. I just want my majority, it seems like. Simon damaged. Shoot guard on phone, see? Right, we're gonna call that there. We'll come back. We'll come back to the next episode. Right, what a good flipping scene. Wow.